there's Montana de Oro. Valencia Peak. Oro Rock. All right. We got the Genoa out. Here's the long motor sailing north, the touch of wind. Six and a half knots. You know, we might be held together with shoestring and gorilla tape. Like our main right up there. But we're gonna get back to Morro Bay one way or another. After we rounded Point Conception and the motor issues were finally resolved and deduced to unpolished diesel, we were beginning to see the light at the end of this 24 hours awake tunnel, which featured one ripped mainsail, fuel filter issues, bypassing an anchorage into an all-nighter, two different swells, and on and off winds. Rather than motor sailing directly into wind up coast, we made one big tack somewhere south of Santa Maria so we could be close hauled and sail into our new home port of Morro Bay. It didn't take long after the tack for the whales to start reaching and Takades to start flowing. Lovely wife ton of who started this oh. whole crazy adventure <laughs> and kept us well fed Thanks. and took initiative and Cheers. sailed and was always excited. First morning here in Morro Bay, just the two of us. Well, actually, Ember and Ash as well. Ember, Ash, come! Ember, come! Ash doesn't really listen. <laughs> Ash, Ember, come. There we go. Oh, jeez. <laughs> I got my cup of coffee. What's on the agenda today, hun? I don't know. <laughs> you don't need to keep smiling. I'm going to edit all this. Don't worry. <laughs> I don't know. Um, uh, we can go take the wheel home and clean it up. Varnish it. Take the pin. Clean those up because they're all flaky. Um, I was more meaning like, what are we doing today? Like, am I gonna go surf? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I might surf. I do and... know that you went outside and you opened the hatch and you made it really sunny and it's got a really chilly breeze. And I'm cold now. It's very sad. Um, we're just gonna start the day, do some boat projects and see where we get. But here, I'll show you how beautiful it is here in town on this beautiful Saturday morning. Please don't smoke coffee <laughs> Okay, let's see. There's a rock. And that is where I'm going to go surf this morning. Not too Sorry, bad to start. <laughs> don't do that, Grant. Should we start the day? We should start the day. Well, there go the girls, all three of them, Ember, Ash, and Noelle. And Noelle's being kind and just letting Ash go for a ride. See? Having so much fun. That's how our dogs play. 
It's so awesome. Did you see Ash on the nose with my board? <laughs> we made it. So I fixed up the bridle today per suggestions of some friends. Brought that them shorter and then also added this forward line that goes to the tip of our bowsprit so that when if when the boat sometimes sails up on the ball it'll keep it from running into the the boat which is nice we'll see if that works it holds everything up it looks really good kind of a three-point bridle system and uh yeah the dogs are enjoying i'm gonna go grab our free diving stuff and we're gonna do a quick little drift to see if we can find some halibut in the shallows and uh and then Looks like it's stacking up for a little kite surfing this afternoon. There you go. Oh, yeah! Woo! Crossed my fingers, I don't have to crash it either. Oh, we're good. I wanted to Grant made breakfast this morning. What'd you make, hun? Oatmeal, per your request. It was a secret surprise in it. That is peanut M&M's. And raisins. Peanut M&M's for breakfast on the boat this morning. Okay, so the first few days we had the boat in the harbor, we didn't really do that much work. We had just spent the last five days sailing up from Long Beach. So many highs and so many lows. I remember at one point I actually thought we were going to have to get towed. But on a high note... I had some of the best days diving, surfing, sailing, sharing meals with Grant and Reed, and nothing but the seascape, and I even finished an entire book, one I highly recommend called Sea Wife by Amity Gage. We decided to not think about the boat and the to-do list that came along with it, and just enjoy our first few days with Mundial. The boat list is long, and some future episodes may include the following... Water heater and solar panel installations, repairing the fridge, new mainsail, making the water maker, rearranging electronics, plumbing, electrical, dreaming, lots and lots of dreaming, and just some TLC. Nothing like a late afternoon thingy ride. Just me and the girls. Okay, well, I'm just gonna sit and my butt's gonna get all wet. This is what happens when your dinghy has a big leak in it. I was the one that invented the you run it out there and leave it in the water. Yeah. Alright, which way is it? We're going out. We are rowing back to our boat. Boom y'all right now because our dinghy has a leak. That's not why we're going back. We're going back because... Because you don't want to get a BUI? 